We are often living in a world of labels, and labels separate us from one another. They slow down our human potential. One out of four families in the United States must deal with a particular label that creates concern. It is facing the stigma of having a mental illness. We don't want to be associated with limitations or disabilities. We want to be associated with what is possible. Literally hundreds of people each year come participate and don't find themselves being labeled or diagnosed. You'll notice that our artwork does not put a label, it puts an artist's name, and if the artist chooses to sell their work, a price set by the artist, but whatever label or baggage they may bring is left outside the door. It's about giving people an opportunity to grow, certainly, and what you see is that the person who is teaching rises to a level, perhaps, that they've not experienced before, and the group comes with them. It's very exciting, and it creates that sense of we as opposed to someone else telling me what to do. I've seen people transition um, from not being so great at art to really coming into their own and learning things they didn't know before and it's really great to see that you're actually you know, making a difference in what somebody's able to do from you know, where they are to where they end up. It's really a good feeling to know that you had a hand in that. And that's where your nose is gonna be on this line. And you don't usually see lines that indicate the size of people's noses unless you're doing a lot of shading. The main thing that accentuates the nose is the bottom. So you only need to worry about drawing the bottom. <coughs> Move on to Art now. is not just a passion. It's like a way of life. I think you see things through a different perspective. You, know, you see more beauty in life compared to the average. So this helps open that up a little bit more in yourself. I've been coming to Night Muses for about three years now. Uh, I love it here. It's my sanctuary. Um, I, I try to come almost every day. Um, I come because I love to do art. It's what I do. It's, um, it's just something that is my passion and I care a lot about it. And the people here um, they accept me for who I am, they don't judge me, and they're very welcoming people. They're good to us, I mean, all of our supplies are free, I mean, they have snacks, coffee, I have a lot of friends here, and the staff, they're pretty friendly, uh, it's like family. And the people here help me deal with that, they help me. Um, be true to myself and they help me relax more and just feel secure in my own skin. I found salvation in this place because it was like my St. Bernard and Avalanche, you know. I, uh, I was going through a lot and still sometimes still have to struggle with what I'm going through. But um, I found my escape in my art and there are some really great artists here that um, it's not just crazy people doing art, there's people um, finding their journeys through art and there's some amazing work here, really amazing work. So I just hope that a lot of people will come visit this place and enjoy what's going on here because it's a place of hope, it's a place of peace, and it's a place of recovery. Throughout the ages, the arts has helped numerous great minds achieve success. With the help of outlets like Nine Muses, more talent comes out. The arts do unlock possibilities.